VegFest is a one-day festival on September 16th here in Winnipeg. Um, it's to celebrate plant-based living, compassion for animals, and also our health and the planet. Our motto is for the animals, for the planet, and for our health. So one of the reasons why we're doing this is because we care deeply about um, the treatment of animals because we don't treat animals very well in North America. So this is a way to show and exercise compassion. We're also doing this because we're concerned about the um, fate of the planet. We're dealing with uh, global warming, we're dealing with deforestation, ocean acidification, dead zones. Most of this has to do, or a lot of this has to do with um, modern industrial animal farming. So moving away from that model towards a more sustainable green eco model of uh, food would be uh, extremely beneficial for the planet. And then lastly, it's also good for public health. I think, you know, the biggest myth out there is that a vegan is bland. I find you're accentuating the natural flavors and the natural sugars and the great, great attributes that a lot of the different vegetables have. And it's not just a plate of vegetables. I mean, there's amazing uh, protein out there in, in, in such forms as legumes, uh, lentils, beans. Uh, there's lots of uh, different types of, uh, you know, soybean products, tofus, you know, and, and different variations of it. There's smoke, there's silken, there's soft, there's hard. I mean, there's a lot of different, uh, different things out there. You just have to try a little bit harder, I mean, I think and uh, you know, and, and focus on using things that are fresh and exciting. So what kind of things are we going to be able to see at VegFest? Um, VegFest has an amazing lineup of speakers from chefs to authors to a race car driver. We have a food and artisan market with um, a ton of really interesting vendors. Um, we have children's activities, an art gallery, yoga and meditation workshops, and so much more. We have uh, six keynote speakers. One of them is Carol Adams. She's a renowned author of the um, best-selling book, The Sexual Politics of Meat. It's about the way that um, food has been gendered, right? So meat is a very macho, masculine kind of food, and salad has been considered very effeminate. If you eat salad in front of your bros, you know, you're not going to be considered manly, right? So her book is a critique of that, uh, that history. We also have Leilani Munter, who is a NASCAR driver, one of the few women NASCAR drivers. And on top of that, she's also a vegan and uh, an environmental activist. We have Camille Labchuk, who is the executive director of Animal Justice, which is a group of lawyers uh, based in Ottawa that speak for animals in court. We have Krista Hidema, who is the director of Mercy for Animals Canada. We also have Dave Nickars, who is the uh, VP of Sea Shepherd Canada. And then we also have Mimi Kirk, who is a raw food chef. Um, she's an author and a renowned speaker. I know a lot of people have this idea that vegan food, like what am I going to do without meat or how am I going to make anything? Um, so it's, it's good to have an open mind and part of the workshop uh, idea is to introduce people on how to sort of transition into this type of lifestyle or, you know, have sort of a meatless Mondays if they want or maybe just an only meat Mondays for the veg curious people. Yeah.